Behind me is the Applegate River Lodge. It's under new ownership, and the new owners say they're excited to put a fresh coat of paint on it while restoring its charm. We have this place in our in our backyard. It's 20 minutes away. It's incredible. Mm -hmm. And so to be able to be a part of that, to provide this experience to people, something that we would enjoy ourselves going to, it's a uh, it's a passion project for us. Meet Anna and Mike Eastman. The two are longtime Rogue Valley residents. Anna fell in love with the Applegate River Lodge when she went to a wedding here 20 years ago. And we just kind of fell in love with the idea of everything it could be and so much potential and the beauty of the Applegate in general. Um, and the fact that there are so many wineries around too, we really loved that and everything we could build off of that. Joanna Davis and her family owned the lodge for the last 30 years, but decided to sell and focus on other things like travel. Now the Eastmans are rebranding the lodge along with Anna's brother, Kelly Beck. They've chosen to rename it the Lindsay, inspired by Lindsay Applegate, a pioneer of the Applegate Trail. They plan to revamp the lodge and restaurant this winter. Placing the floors in here, um, upgrading the rooms a little bit. And then for the restaurant, we have a chef that we've hired and he's going to be revamping the menu. He's going to be revamping kind of the, um, the level of service there as well with, with us. The owners aim to create a refined and welcoming gathering place for locals and visitors to enjoy the Applegate's renowned wine country. They also hope to keep some of the same long-standing traditions in place like weddings, live music, and lodge gatherings. In the backdrop is obviously incredible, so I think with some new life and some new energy, um, this place has a very high potential and we're just excited to see where we can take it.